First at five, a busy weather weekend ahead for the Carolinas. Right now, things seem pretty calm here in the Charlotte area. You can see there the skies over a look of the Charlotte Motor Speedway. Live look there. Uh, but there are some rain and wind that are expected to impact Hatteras Island as a tropical system moves up the coast. Chief Meteorologist Brad Panovich joining us live now from Festival in the Park at Freedom Park, breaking down everything you need to know. It looks like it's getting crowded there too, Brad. Yeah, the crowds are really filling in behind me and every person that walks by is wants to know about the storm and whether it's going to rain tonight or tomorrow because as you can see, it is getting a little cloudy out here, but these are not rain clouds. These are just regular old fashioned clouds that are bringing in some cooler conditions because temperatures have been falling out here with that northeast breeze. Let me show you the local impacts from tropical storm Ophelia. It's going to be a big deal for the coast, but here in the Charlotte area, we're going to luck out. We are going to see windy conditions primarily today, tonight and tomorrow. Could be a gust up to 35 miles per hour. Scattered showers east of I-77, likely tonight and tomorrow, but the chances are much lower than you would anticipate. And really cloudy and cooler. I think that's going to be the big story for all of us as we see a much cooler day tomorrow. There's the storm. You can see the rain bands aren't really making it that far to the west. They're only barely getting to I-95. Now tomorrow they will get closer to us and certainly cannot rule out a stray shower during the day tomorrow, but the winds, that's going to be a big story. Wind gusts today have been gusting as high as 30, 35 miles per hour. The highest gust so far in many locations has been in that 25 to 30 mile per hour range. But if you're heading out here to Festival in the Park, temperatures right now are cooling back into the 70s fairly quickly out here. It is very pleasant. I expect temperatures to hover in the 70s. And tomorrow, yes, we're going to have a small chance of rain, maybe about a 40% chance, but it's going to be really hit or miss. It is not going to wash out your weekend. Coming up, though, we're going to talk about the drying pattern for the rest of the week, and Brittany's going to give you some of the impacts we're going to see from Tropical Storm Ophelia out on the coast.